Okay. I'm going to respond now, now to what Margie polled at Anime North over the Memorial Day weekend. If you don't know what Anime North is, it's basically one of, me, one of, if not the biggest anime convention in the Great White North, which usually happens every Memorial Day weekend in suburban Toronto. No, Ontario, Canada. Well, it seems the con has shown its true colors as a kick-vick convention. As one person who was there on his birthday, an advocate to stand with Vic, I might want to point out, don't know the guy's name, and I'm not going to reveal it, called Jamie Marchi out for her actions. She called it, called him, accused him of harassing him, her, and was carted out of the con on his birthday. And then she had the gall and audacity to tweet a birthday cake emoji. She loves and kisses. Marchi... You really are a lost cause of a woman. You've had your chance to redeem yourself by admitting you're wrong. You're not taking it. You're going to pay for it. False weights and unequal measures. There's the Lord detests double standards of every kind. Proverbs 2010. And what you pulled was a double standard, Marchie. That guy may have been verb. Didn't even physically assault you. He was verbally calling you out for how you treat you, Monica, and Ron have treated the fan base. Instead, you steal, you have him carted out and more or less steal his birthday experience from him. Something he was enjoy, looking to enjoy until you came along and threw him out. Stolen bread tastes sweet, but it turns to gravel in the mouth. Proverbs 2017. Enjoy the bread, the taste of that bread, until it turns to nothing but rocks in your mouth and break your teeth, you shrew. Jeez, Jamie. The fact that you've been dodging the lawyer notices just shows how much of a coward you are. Why don't you brace yourself like a woman like I said a couple of weeks ago when I roasted you? You know, with a passage from the book of Job. Oh. Speaking of which, let's go back to that passage and I can wrap it up. I stopped at, cha at verse 15 of that particular chapter. Where was it? Let's see. Ah, here it is. Have you explored the springs from which the seas come? Have you explored their depths? Do you know where the gates of death are located? Have you seen the gates of other gloom? Do you realize the extent of the earth? Tell me about it if you know. Where does the light come from, and where does darkness go? Can you take each to its home? Can, do you know how to get there? But of course you know all of this. For you were born before it was all created, and so you are ver so very experienced. Have you visited the storehouses of the snow, or seen the storehouses of hail? I have reserved them as weapons for the time for times of trouble, for the day of battle and war. Where is the path to the source of light? Where is the home of the east wind? Who created a channel for torrents of rain? Who laid out the path for the lightning? Who makes the rain fall on barren land? Who <coughs> in a desert where no one lives? Who sends rain to satisfy the parched ground to make the tender grass spring up? Does the rain have a father? Who gives birth to the dew? 
who is the mother of the ice, who gives birth to the frost of the he from the heavens. For water turns into ice as hard as rock, and the surface wa of the water freezes. Can you direct the movement of the stars, binding the clusters of the of Pelleades, or loosening the cords of Orion? Can you direct the constellations through the seasons? Or guide the bear with her cubs across the heavens? Do you know the laws of the universe? Can you even use them to regulate the earth? Can you shout to the clouds and make it rain? Can you make lightning appear and cause it to strike as you direct? Who gives intuition to the heart and instinct to the mind? Who is wise enough to <coughs> count all the clouds? Who can tilt the water jars of heaven? When the parched ground is dry and the soil is hardened in the clods, can you stalk prey for Linus and satisfy the young lion's appetites as they lie in their dens or crouch in the thicket? Who provides food for the ravens when their young cry out to God and wander about in hunger? Job 6, 38, 16 through 41. So I'm asking you, Jamie, where do you get off running away from questions you know that need to be asked? That we know you won't answer. Where do you get off, Jamie? thinking you can get away from the truth. And where do you get off thinking you can evade the courts for long? Justice will be brought to down upon your head. I swear it on the most, on the son, on the name of, swear it to God. I swear as in I promise you that to God Almighty. If I really were this, I would have hunted you down and have you incarcerated. For in brightest day, in blackest night, no evil shall escape my sight. Let those who worship evil's might beware my power, Green Lantern's light! I stand with Vic now, then, forever. I love that love that umbrella guy. And shout outs to Hero Hey, SG Sammy, that umbrella guy who's my I guess you could say my boss, even though I didn't get Penny out of the donos. Knows on the super chats. Well, a, my boss to an extent. Nick Riccada, Senpai is home, and so forth. Keep up. We need to keep up the battle, guys. We may be near the end. We may be getting close to the goal. But now we got to cross the finish line and find Funimation guilty. Goodbye. Mets 2128 signing out. Like, comment on the, like and comment on the video. Subscribe to my channel. Goodbye. And good night. Bang.